Today I'm going to do something a little different. I'm going to do a cooking demonstration in which I'm going to show people how you prepare a beer stew using a crock pot. The recipe I'm using is found in the Rival crock pot cookery which is a cookbook that many people get when they buy a crock pot slow cooker and that's you know on the top of the cover is what the crock pot looks like so anyway here's the recipe for beer stew you get one and a half to two pounds of beef like this you cut it into cubes one and a half inch pieces using a cutting board like this and a culinary knife this type which is what I like to use you cut the meat and you place it into a 10 inch or 12 inch frying pan like this and I like to use an anodized nonstick frying pan you put the meat in there you saute it for a couple minutes till it's brown add a little bit of oil like this so it browns and then you put the meat in your slow cooker after you've started the slow cooker you add one 12 ounce bottle of beer and what I'm using is the Youngling black and tan lager which I think is has a nice rich taste you pour that into the crock pot and then you take a measuring cup add one cup of water and then get vegetable or beef or chicken bouillon add one teaspoon of this bouillon to the crock pot and then at that point you just start adding vegetables as you see fit the recipe says that you add one to two large onions like this, a Vidalia onion. Chop it up into pieces using a little chopper knife like this or a paring knife like that. And then you add to your stew, you add two, kel two celery sticks, two carrots which are peeled using a carrot potato peel or something like this type and then you can add one leek or what I use one or two potatoes which are peeled using my potato peeler thing and then once that's cooked for a while you add two more celery sticks some spices, maybe a tomato if you want, and then you can chop up and add another onion like this. Then you just set the crock pot on cook for six to eight hours and let it sit. And then after you let it sit and plug in the crock pot, you get a stew that looks something like this. It's a beer stew with carrots, potatoes or leeks, onions, and pieces of beef chopped up, and I think most people will like it. Bon appetit.